Hi everyone, welcome to today's webinar here at Tea Time with Demacus. Today, we'll be discussing the cybersecurity threats and trends in 2021. Today, we're going to take a closer look at cybersecurity. Specifically, we'll see the top predictions for this year and the threats and trends in cybersecurity of 2021. As the world recovers from COVID-19 and enters a new normal, it realizes a lot has changed. How will those changes affect the safety of your digital landscape? And how will you be able to protect it? Let's find out. Here are five forecasts for 2021 that you should keep track of. The first one being, remote work raises risks to cybersecurity. There is no question that the shift to a work from home reality will continue to impact digital security. In fact, a Skybox report reveals that one third of staff in 70% of organizations will remain remote 18 months from now. Their dependency on cloud computing and collaborative tools such as Slack, Skype, and Zoom will continue to be a risk factor. And the lack of sufficient oversight may cause further problems to cyber safety. Left on their own, employees will put convenience over security first. They'll use unsecured channels to transfer sensitive data and personal devices and home routers to handle those data flows. Without robust IT support, these security shortcuts will continue to pose a threat and a good opportunity for cyber criminals to seek easy targets for maximum damage. The second is cloud security becomes the new focus area. As businesses turn remote, the rate of cloud adoption will continue to accelerate in 2021. In fact, 35% of companies plan on stepping up migration to the cloud, according to a survey by Ribic. To combat new cybersecurity threats to the evolving cloud infrastructure, we'll see companies increase spending on cloud security, which could double in comparison to 2020. According to Gartner, another trend that may emerge is the distributed cloud model. In this hybrid model, businesses will migrate data to both the public and private cloud, which could benefit cloud security in a remote setting. The third is the threat of business email compromise indoors, or BEC. BEC isn't among the latest cybersecurity threats, but we may see a surge in attacks over the coming months as more people use both their personal and professional emails to conduct business remotely. And while people may be aware of BEC, working from home makes them vulnerable to this type of attack. The lack of security and a lax attitude of employees at their remote offices makes them the ideal targets for cyber criminals. In such an environment, it's easy for attackers to replicate known sources they can then send seemingly legitimate requests and scam people to freely hand over money or data and in doing so, exploit the general negligence of the remote workforce. Using IT security services can help you prevent BEC attacks and safeguard your business. The fourth is death by cyber attack could become a possibility. Future cybersecurity threats may evolve with real world implications as human lives are placed at risk due to cyber attacks. Last year in Germany, a homicide investigation followed a cyber attack in a hospital in Dusseldorf. The attack caused a systems shutdown, which may have been the reason for the death of a patient there. It's still unclear whether the investigation will lead to prosecution, but if it does, it will be the first registered case of someone dying as a direct result of a cyber attack. The fifth is detection, not just prevention or protection. Despite these increased threats, a new hope may arrive for cyber defense. In 2021, we may see renewed interest in systems that detect cyber threats, not just those that prevent them or protect you from cyber attacks. One such detection technology trend is Cloud SIEM, or Security Information and Event Management. With SIEM tools, IT teams could potentially use the system to hunt for attackers and expose them before they gain access to valuable data. Businesses could integrate these tools and others like it into a broader cybersecurity ecosystem as well. Thanks to SOAR, or Security Orchestration Automation and Response, IT teams could augment tools like Cloud SIEM. They can then, for example, use it to collect data about top security threats and create defenses that automatically respond to potential attacks. Another tool that may see a wide-scale application in 2021 is UEBA, or 
user and entity behavior analytics. Cybersecurity professionals could use UEBA's deep learning to analyze patterns in user behavior. Based on these patterns, users can create models that detect behavior associated with cyber attacks. If you'd like to learn more about the Democus Technologies cybersecurity detection and prevention plans, contact us. Thanks for watching and I hope to see you guys back here on our next webinar here at Tea Time with Democus.